Hey guys, what's going on? It's King Clutch here, and today, guys, we're back in the NBA 2K21. I hope you guys are having a great day and everything's going well for you guys. Today, we're going to do this. I'm going to be showing you guys how you can build Kyrie Irving here in NBA 2K21. You guys are going to be making this build your point guard. I'm going to go right handed, jersey number 11. Again, handed this jersey number that stuff doesn't matter. I would definitely go with the point guard for Kyrie, though, guys. For this build, I'm going to make them 6'2, 195. I'm going to go with a 6'4 wingspan. Body shape doesn't matter. I'll go with salad, but you can pick whatever you want. Now, guys, everyone knows Kyrie pretty much has the best handles in the league. Like, probably the best handles. You could definitely argue for the best handles we've ever seen. I would max out ball handle, speed with ball. You could just max out all these playmaking stats. I can definitely see the argument literally giving him 30 playmaking badges and just going with it. The only issue with that is you're not going to be able to get as well rounded of a build. Um, I'm going to speed and excel. You could go all the way to 93. I'm just going to go with 91s. I would give this build some perimeter D. Now, guys, Kyrie's actual build has no defensive badges. I would just leave it like this and give yourself four. I feel like that's a good number. Um, and just, I really, I would just go with that. Now, I would give him three-point shot in mid-range. You're going to want to be able to shoot with this build. You don't want to just be able to play make. Like, that just, uh, that's obvious. Um, and honestly, I would probably give him, like, 12 shooting badges. If you want to go with this max out 30 playmaking badges, it's definitely useful. And then you're going to want to give him driving layup. No, you're not going to get any finishing badges doing that way. So my thing with this is if you spend it on a post control, standing dunk, and driving dunk, you can at least get five. Now, for some reason, whenever you, you know, if you spend it this way, you get finishing badges. If you just spend it on close shot and driving layup, you don't get any finishing badges. You just don't. Like, look at this. You don't upgrade. That's 79. You're not getting anything. Same thing here. You can max it out, but you're not getting any badges. It just doesn't help you. Like, I'd rather have the, def or I'd rather have the badges. You could go like this, and this is going to give you... Uh, five finishing badges but we didn't touch our driving layup which i get like Kyrie should have but with this we can at least get all those close shot badges so i'm just gonna leave it like this again touch driving layup if you want it i get Kyrie can do driving layups like that's his game but again it just doesn't work i'm just gonna go with the close shot instead you can you know try supplementing it that's gonna give you two and it's only to a 68 it's just extremely expensive so that's your option you have that's your choice um, again, do whatever you like with that. Um, you could tweak it however you want. I'm just going to leave it like this. We're going to finish with 5, 11, 30, and 5. Now, these, you can just spend wherever you want. Um, but 5, 11, 30, and 5, guys, is what I'm going to go with. Now, for these takeovers, again, you could give them playmaking takes. I don't like playmaking takes. I'm going to go with ankle-breaking shots so we can break some ankles. And uh, honestly, I'm just going to go with that and limitless and go with these. And for this build, we're going to be getting a offensive threat, which I think works for Kyrie. We're going to get shades of Steve Nash, Darius Garland, and Dame. Um, but when it comes to this build, again, the badges, you know, fit these towards your play style. And for these finishing badges, I'm going to go ahead and just give him Giant Slayer um, Pro Touch and just go with those for these finishing badges. Now for these shooting badges, again, I feel like you could have more, more of these, to be honest. But I'm just going to go with these here, throw them all on silver. Um, and then really, I just put these two on gold, circus threes and difficult shots, and I'm going to go with those. Now for these playmaking badges, this is obviously Kyrie's best category. I would put Handles Raise on Hall of Fame, Ankle Breaker on Hall of Fame, Quick First Step on Hall of Fame. Um, I had to use Bailout probably just on bronze. Um, now a lot of these, you kind of have a few options. I'd use Space Creator. You can use Floor General if you want. I think having 30 playmaking badges, you probably should, but again, you don't need to. Special Delivery will give us those crazy passes, so I'm going to use that. I'm also going to use Bullet Passer on Silver. Break starter you can use if you want. I'm gonna use bullet passer, relay passer, stop and go tight handles and unpluckable all on bronze, and then just go with needle threader on silver and go with these instead of going with floor general. But you can definitely use it. I feel like it's really probably the better idea. I'm just gonna go with these though. Defensive badges, guys, I'm gonna just use clamps here on silver, ankle braces on bronze, and off ball pass. Now instead of ankle braces, you could just go with pick dodger and then honestly put this on like trapper and just go with these guys. But this is how you guys can build a Kyrie Irving build here in NBA 2K21. If you guys are new to the channel, please subscribe for more NBA 2K21 builds. But anyway, guys, Benky Glutch here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Anyways, have a great extra day and peace out, guys. Thanks.